This show contains scenes of violence and coarse language. Viewer discretion is advised. Put your fucking hands up. Oh, I shit. Your fucking head. Okay, okay, okay. Alright. You, you don't need to do this. You sound, you sound so familiar. I do have to do this. How's it going from there, Quinn? I'm real good. Joseph? Yeah. Yeah. What the fuck, yeah. man? Still looking for your fucking family? You want your fucking you, family? I mean... You don't need to do this, Joseph. I could help you. Please don't fucking kill me, man. Oh, shit. Shit. No. Let me go, man. Fuck. Hey, it's Quint. Quint here. He's hurt bad. He's right out here. Come on. Alright, hang on, buddy. Hang on, buddy. Hang on, buddy. Uh, there's blood everywhere. Where you actually get at? Uh, in the shoulder, close to the lung. I don't know, guys. I can. He's out. He's out. Bad buffalo, but I don't know what to do about this. Let's get him up. I'm having fun, guys. Yeah, I'm getting pressure on that one. Might be going in the shot. How much we can do? I love you, Daddy. Is that you? Are you okay? Oh shoot, oh shoot. Quinn, uh, Quinn, 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 I don't even know anymore. I am. So you say your name is Joe? Is that short for anything? Joseph. Last name's Hodge. I finally found him. Kill, 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 kill him. Right now. Joseph Hodge. I the Link would be around. Link. Oh. Strange name. Sounds familiar. Had some friends, and they spoke of a guy they knew called Link. Maybe it's the same guy. I mean, what a strange name like that. <laughs> you would expect it. Maybe it's the same guy. I, I don't know. Probably is the same guy. Not very many people talking these days. Hmm. Okay, Eddie, you want to tell me what the fuck you're waiting for? Um, I need to take a piss or something. <laughs> you don't mind? I mean, it is the apocalypse after all, but uh, I uh, still prefer a little privacy when I do that. <laughs> I'll take that tree behind over there. Yeah, go knock yourself out. 
Uh, be right back in a second. I didn't know what to do. I was so confused. I had to step back and think. The voices that were just overwhelming. Eddie, please don't fight this. You have to do this. That's a good boy. Alright, I'm back. And I would like you to uh, put your fucking hands up right now. Right now, and if you do one false movement, I don't want to. I don't want to have to kill you right now. Up. I'm not putting them up. Why? I'm not gonna reach for anything. And I'm not putting my fucking hands up. Okay, do me a favor then. At least drop your guns. Right now, I see two I'm guns. Gonna do that. If I put my hand on my gun, I am going to kill you. You understand that. I might not be by myself, so you can lower that weapon and we can have a conversation about what this is about. Conversation about what? I, 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 I know who you are. You made a... I don't know who you are, and you've got a gun pointed at me. Well... People for less. We can have a conversation, as long as you don't do any false movement, and I would prefer to have my gun raised at the moment, if you don't mind. Uh, just because I think you'll understand why in a second. So, you say you're not alone. You look alone right now. Oh, trust me, I know the person I am. Uh, well, yeah, I kind of know who you are. <laughs> you remember a man called Quinn Bauer? A country singer. You probably heard of him. Oh, I, I know him and Val. But they've never spoke of you. Let me guess, I killed Quinn, and you're here to exact justice? Mm. Justice on a man who never spoke twice of you. None of them did. Mm, that can't be true. And I don't even know you. Oh, it's true. I... So what did you do with the band? Road manager, tour manager? I, uh... I, I, I was the producer and manager. I mean, I was doing two jobs at once. You basically led them lives that got them money and fame. They're well known. And you're just <sighs> forgotten about. Even in the apocalypse, they never looked for you. No. I was more worried about going home. But maybe he thought I was dead already. I was stuck in a bus. I did see him leave me. Abandon me like everybody always fucking does. But... But he probably had a good reason. There's no way he would have just left me there if he thought there was a chance. I, I don't even know if he was looking for me. I, I frankly don't care. What really bothers me is that you killed him. Why, where, how, doesn't really matter anymore. I told you I wasn't alone. You got a way of doing things, me and Link. Link? Infiltrate groups. Yeah, Link. What? Last name Blackburn. One plus one, Eddie. He, Link betrayed he Quinn. Him. He's with fucking Joseph. I, 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 shut up. Now what are you waiting for? Kill this son of a bitch. <clears throat> you see, I, I... The only reason I'm still alive is because I've been hunting you down. I've been trying to... No. I wanted to find you. Then what's your purpose after you kill me? You I'm, have no purpose. I do have a purpose. I... I'm a human just like you. I deserve to live. I, I don't know what I'm useful for in this world. But one thing's for sure is I'm still fucking alive. And I'm the one pointing the gun at you this time. He was the nicest fucking man and you took him away. <sighs> I didn't take him away. I gave him freedom. He's probably up at some imaginary place with flying winged people with his wife and daughter. You love him so much, you take the barrel under your chin and send yourself there. What's that going to solve? You're still going to be roaming the land around here. You're still going to be the man that decides who gets to live. Kill him or I do it. <sighs> when you say I'm strong, if I'm so strong, why can't I pull this fucking trigger? You know I'm right. <sighs> God, I, 
hate to admit it, but I think you're right. I, I think you're right, you son of a bitch. <laughs> All right, enough of the plane here, Mr. Hodge. Eddie is not really the type to be able to do things on his own. <laughs> I can take care of that for him. I kind of like you, though. That's a problem. You've got guts. You see, I... I'm the type of guy that has a craving to kill people. And I don't... Well... I don't really give a shit who the fuck you are. And again, you going around deciding for people doesn't make me too happy either. Stop. Don't... Don't do this. Stop it, Eddie. Stomach decides for me. Yeah, your stomach. Well, I'm guessing you're talking about that gut of yours. Now, if you've got friends around here, I would suggest you immediately tell them to come out and play with us. Or shoot me dead right now. Before I decide to do what Eddie can't fucking do. I'm gonna let you know right now. I'm not gonna do that either. You're gonna wish you never pointed that fucking weapon at me ever again. Okay, well, let's be clear. The first person who pointed the weapon was Eddie. Now I think I crammed him far back in his fucking head. It's just you and me. By the way, Mr. Hodge, my name is Sid. Pleased to meet you. Well, as you can see, Eddie has been only strong enough because of me. I'm the one who's keeping him real, as they say. <laughs> I'm the one who's making sure he gets to live to see another fucking day. And I think that with you around, and with everything going on right now, that's not really going to happen. Yeah, so, since I'm calling the shots and you're not right now, I think the best thing for me to do would probably take you down. But then again, if you do have a little fucking pussies hiding out here, they might take me down, unless I'm able to make a break for it quick enough. I don't know, a lot of things happening at once here. And if nobody's around, somebody spotted me they know who I am right and then they'll be coming after me so either way it seems like I'm not really gonna get out of this easy <laughs> but you know what uh, I like to think that I might as well uh, take my chances and do what Eddie can't fucking do so I'm sorry mr. Hodge but I'm going to have to say good night it's been fun too yeah. much fun well, fuck you too. <laughs> Although I don't support Sid taking over, maybe it was best that he did at that point. It took a while for me to come back to myself, but I eventually did. And then I didn't know what to do with myself. I didn't know if I should stay or go. The military completely gave up on everyone. Not even religion can save me. But one thing's for sure, before anything, I needed to head to Altar. I changed my look a little bit. I'm kind of fearful that maybe that Link guy, he might be after me. Maybe not. I'm not taking my chances. Sorry it took so long, Quinn. But it's done. Joseph Hodge is dead. I'm so sorry I brought you here, man. I, I, I don't know what I was thinking. I've learned so much since being out here, surviving, trying to stay sane. It's difficult, man. You have no idea what it's like to be me. And my job is the only thing that kept me going. It's the only thing that really gave me a reason to be, you know? I guess the voices and stuff weren't so overwhelming then. <sighs> I miss you, man. I 
I feel really bad for what I did. I, I never wanted to force you to come here. I, I wish you could have stayed home with your wife and daughter. It's not right what I did, and, and I hope by killing Joseph, I, I did something right. I'm really sorry. Please forgive me, Quinn. So you see, Alyssa Morgan, that, that's my story. I killed him, and it's his fault, and he took over. Just like that. There's nothing I can do about it. He, he can take over anytime he wants, it doesn't matter. I've, I've tried taking more pills, and this is why I, this is why I need you. It's, because I don't know what to do. I don't know. I, 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 I I okay, if you came up to know right now, it's okay. We're gonna work through this together, okay? I, I wanna ask you a few questions about how this is how this has progressed. I know you're very upset. And, and you have every right to do. So there was a period of time when you didn't have your medication, right? And during yes. this time Sid became very strong is what it sounds like, is that correct? Yeah. Yeah. And you even ended up, well, Sid ended up threatening some of your close friends. But they ended up helping you find some of your medication, correct? About how long ago was that? A uh, month? I, I really lost track of time. Maybe a month. And how long were you without your medication? <sighs> it had been easily two, three months. Okay, that's good. That's good, Eddie. This, this gives us some clues. Okay, I know it feels hopeless right now. But listen to what you've just told me. You were without your medication for three months. And during that Kill time, right there now. was something... She's going to tell happened. everyone. And, and I think that this has to do with, with the power of the mind, the power of faith. Mm -hmm. It doesn't have to be the same faith that you had before. But when we can find something to believe in, that can be helpful. Kill her. Kill her. You've also <laughs> told me that you've only very recently restarted your medication. Now remember, Eddie, psychotropic meds often take six to eight weeks to fully get back into your system. It's just kill her, kill her, kill her. I'm gonna run out of pills. Mm -hmm. We don't have any more. We've looked everywhere. It's not easy to come by these types of medication. I've got one left now. Four, three or four pills left. <laughs> And I take two at a time, usually. You're an idiot, you're an Rip idiot, you're fingers an idiot. Off. I, I don't know what I'm gonna do after. That's what I'm afraid of. You're fucking stupid. Idiot. Idiot. That's idiot. why I'm here. I, I, I don't know, I... She's gonna tell everyone about you. I, what am I gonna do? And they'll kill you. Kill her right now. The voices right now are overwhelming and I'm on medication. Cause you're a fucking idiot. They won't shut up. Kill her right now. I'm gonna ask if you can hear anybody else talking right now. Kill her. Yes. Kill all the time. Spill her guts. Spill her guts. Kill her now. It's hard to hear you sometimes. Mm -hmm. and, and, you know, I'm sorry about that. It's okay. It's alright. What are they telling you, Eddie? Cut the tongue. Kill her right now. Rip her eyes out. It, it's too much. Kill her right now. Kill her. Kill her. They're telling me to kill you. I don't want to do kill that. Kill and kill yourself. Kill. Rip her apart. They're saying that you're gonna say everything. That you're gonna say everyone. Rip her limbs Rip off. Rip off me. I, I, I know you wouldn't do that, right? I mean... I would never do that. I would never do that. I, I, it's too... It's, I can't... Kill her. Kill her. Kill her. <laughs> they won't shut up right now. Why won't they shut up? Because you're a fucking idiot. Why won't they shut up? Kill her right now. I can't. Eddie. You can do this. Be here with me. Talk with me. Be here with me. What do I do? What do I do when I run out of pills? What do I do then? We can only worry about this minute. But I will help you. I, I can't do this. Alyssa, I can't. Do it. You don't understand. Eddie. You don't know what it's like to be like me. 
and to have to listen to all these voices. Kill yourself or kill her. Just kill something. You don't know what it's like. Kill, kill, kill. You just can't know. You can't know. You can't know. No. Stay away. Please, you can't do this. Don't do this. Stay here with me and we'll work this out together. Eddie. How can you work this out? I'm gonna run out of pills and then I'm gonna start killing people and I don't kill people. I have an entire <laughs> we will scour this entire country if we have to. This is not the answer, Eddie. You're an idiot, you're an idiot, you're an idiot. <laughs> Stay away from me! <laughs> oh, Eddie. Eddie, I'm sorry. Dad, I'm sorry. No, I couldn't let you do that. Where's my gun? I'm sorry I had to hit you. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, I don't know yeah. what I was thinking. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Of course. Miss Morgan, you are amazing. I just, I can't believe I was going to die. I was going to shoot myself. Oh my god! Not on my watch. <laughs> oh my god, I feel so lightheaded right now. Oh, thank you for knocking some sense into me. Okay, you had you had a really really tense moment. You know, everybody has those moments where you know, sometimes everything seems bigger than what we can do on Earth. But that's what I mean. We're here together. Thank you. We don't have to do this alone. Two more seconds, and I was. I was, I was gone. I can't kill myself. I mean, I still got some friends out there. And I got you. All right? You can help me. That's right. It's a permanent solution to a temporary problem, Eddie. Oh, yeah. I feel all right right now. Better. Quite a punch, Miss Morgan. You really do. <laughs> uh, I was gonna lose you there, Eddie. Yeah. No, hey. I wanted to see you. If I wouldn't have come to see you, I think I would have. I would have probably done it. I'm really glad that I could be here with you tonight, then. Yes. Uh, I, I I don't feel safe though without my gun. You don't mind? I go get that. Actually, you, you seem a, a lot calmer. Uh, your shakes appear to have disappeared. Yeah, I, you, you don't even seem to be reacting as much to the voices. Uh. The voices are completely gone right now. Right this oh. instant, I feel normal. Feels good. Hey, maybe you just need a good right hook every now and then, huh? <sighs> maybe. Yeah. Uh, well, uh, where's that thing? I don't see it. I just out in the hallway. Oh, okay. You never know, you know, those spiders, I, I just wouldn't want to be stuck without it, you know. <sighs> Absolutely. Ah, oh, damn. I still can't believe I almost, almost did that. <laughs> you know, Eddie, you're right when you say that I, I can't... Watch out, Alyssa, it's not me, it's Sid. Right. Yep. All that blah, blah, blah. All that blah, blah, blah. <laughs> Hi, Alyssa. I don't think we've met before. But you know of me, right? Yeah, yeah. That's right. We all know what you're gonna do with your little group in Alcyon. You're gonna go blab about who he really is. Okay, now before I continue here, I want you to drop that fucking weapon. Uh, so, go ahead and drop everything right here. No problem. Trying to control Eddie. I'm the one who does that. But you know what? I'm actually happy you stopped him. Because he wasn't going to kill you. So, I'm going to go ahead and do that for him. He put in a down. Jesus Christ, how many fucking weapons you've got? Alright, there's that axe on your back too. 
It's everything. Mm -hmm. It's everything. It's everything. Okay. Isn't it enough? Right, right here. Stand right here, right now. Right fucking now. Let's go. Fucking simple task. Good. And what are you gonna do? Good. What are you gonna do? From if the bullet, okay? If I hadn't done that, you wouldn't even be here. <clears throat> you know what it's like to be Eddie. You know you don't. You say you do, sort of, but you don't. No, I don't. I don't. And you kindly get on your knees. It makes things easier. Thank you. So, you don't understand, you know, I like to hurt people, but Eddie doesn't. I'm like his dark side, but I think you fucking figured that one out already. You're gonna have a whole world of shit come down on you. <laughs> You're Alyssa Morgan from Alcyon, right? You got all your friends over there, those pals of yours, that little fucking pussy buddy. <laughs> I'm gonna fight each and every one of them one by one before they even know you're fucking dead. I'd like to do a little something with you, something Eddie uh, never has to guess to do. You know, when he gets to corner someone. Where's this thing? Oh, there it is. <laughs> well, sharp enough. What will it take to make you feel better? Make me feel better. You think this is just to make me feel better? This is who I am. Uh, stand up. <laughs> stand up. Stand up. Stand, stand, stand up. Stand up. Shut up. Shut up. Stand up, please. Stand up. I'm being, I'm being polite. Stand up. Okay. 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 You know what I heard one day? It was a man who said it takes like four or five minutes for somebody to bleed out, and fucking die, and I kind of want to try that. I really, really want to try that. Yeah, that's right, Mr. Quaid. I like that guy. I'm gonna go ahead and test his theory out, if you don't mind. Please turn. Okay. Come on, Jesus Christ! Oh my God! Yeah, there we go. <laughs> yeah, you sit there, fucking bleed. Oh, now you got this fucking knife all dirty. <laughs> Shit, you see, Miss Morgan. <laughs> you come across people that hurt you, but that's because I couldn't do anything to stop the hurting, you know, and, and now I'm here, and I'm gonna get rid of these pills right out this fucking window. Eddie, if you can hear me, you can fight him. <laughs> oh, keep quiet. You see, I'm the one who's holding the power now. I'm the one who's gonna make the decisions from now on. I'm the one who's going to decide everything, including your fucking fate. So, yeah. Hey, what? Drop everything right now. Drop whoa, 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 whoa. Right now, drop your weapons on the floor. Whoa. Listen, Miss Morgan. Weapons on the floor. <sighs> okay, hold on. Let me take him down. Gotta put it in my hands first. Okay, I'm gonna drop it, okay? Try anything funny. Calm down, woman! Hey, calm down! Oh. You alright? Is that blood? I was sick. Yeah. Oh god, oh god. Oh, oh, oh god. Oh, what's up? Oh god, it wasn't Eddie. It was sick. It was sick. And he was sick. Does he have friends? Yes, he has friends. I don't know how to contact them now. Oh, God. Oh, oh, hey guys, didn't see you there. <laughs>
Uh, yeah, stupid joke. Anyways, um, amazing series. I've, I've had so much fun with this character, with Eddie Beck. So I, uh, I really want to thank uh, the old Quinn crew. And um, even thank Jessica, uh, played by X Eli, that I tried to hit with a baseball bat. Props to you. Um, you guys helped. You helped Eddie um, progress well into this story, and um, and I can't thank you enough for that. Really. I also want to thank Rampage. Yes, uh, who plays Quaid? Thank you for being the first person to take me hostage and make it one of the best experiences of my life in this game. Um, a big thanks to my close uh, brothers and sisters. Yes, my brothers and sisters in this beautiful series. Uh, and of course, everyone else in the Maker Group. There are so many to, you know, uh, start naming names. But you guys are all phenomenal. And the father to um, everyone's superb role play. I've really enjoyed my time in that group. And a very, very special thanks to Joseph Hodge, uh, who's played by Prosthetic Monkey. Uh, seriously, this is the guy who brought me here in, in this uh, community, who brought me to uh, to play uh, RP on, on DayZ. So I've never RP'd before. He brought me here, and ever since I fell in love with this uh, this whole community, the whole concept of RPing. Uh, Monkey, thank you so much, man. You're fucking great. You're a great friend. You're a great guy. Don't change. Um, you've played a fantastic role of a villain, and you've done it all the way through. Um, so, so thank you, man. Like, you're really awesome. And I, I can't, I can't, you know, not thank Alyssa Morgan from Alcyon. Uh, you know, Buddy was in Alcyon in that school, and Alyssa Morgan was running the whole show, right? Like, at the school there. Well, she uh, turns out to be, you know, as you've seen, Eddie's therapist throughout the whole story. I've been telling her the story, which you've all seen the series, and it ended the way it ended with her. And she's a phenomenal uh, role player. I think she's done something great with Alcyon. Actually, you're gonna. I'm probably gonna release an episode. It's gonna be uh, Chinaris has got talent. Uh, I was actually a judge on there with Sister Caroline. And uh, yeah, so it's like it was a great event. Unfortunately, it didn't make the cut into the series because I didn't think it was really relevant with the story. However, I might actually make a video on this. I uh, I really want to thank the Daisy RP community, everybody I've bumped into, uh, everybody has provided me nothing but excellent role play. So you guys are awesome. The community is great. So thank you so much. You've made my experience um, absolutely great. Um, also, a special, special, very extra special thanks to the donators, you guys that, that that gave, you know, throughout this whole time. They showed me an extra amount of support, and I owe you all a huge thanks. So I love you guys, and, and of course, I gotta thank you guys, the viewers. <laughs> I mean, without you guys checking out my videos, it's pretty much pointless, right? So in the end, you guys are the biggest thank you. You guys are watching this. You're commenting all the time. It's it's just friggin' fantastic. This, the amount of support is too damn high. <laughs> it's like really good. So thank you guys. You guys are like the friggin' best. And now like the big question is, what's coming up next? Is there gonna be another series? Well, hell yeah, there's gonna be another series. I just I don't know when, guys. I need a little break, right? Just a little break. I need to you know figure out what I'm going to be doing for the next series and everything, you know, and like any TV show, you need a little break eventually, you know, and this is sort of like a TV show, I guess. <laughs> but as for what's coming up next, I'm not too sure. Um, it could be anything. If you've guys got like suggestions or anything, go ahead and write them down there. Some of you may have watched my streams and you know that I play a couple new characters right now. You know, speaking about streaming and stuff, uh, Y'all, well, some of you know that I have a uh, Twitch um, Twitch channel, so if you want to watch me play some live gaming in between series and stuff like that and videos and you want to see some more, then come on over to Twitch, and the links are in the description below, and you'll be able to watch me play some uh, live gaming. Just make sure you... Um, Make sure you follow and make sure that you turn on those notifications so you know when I'm, uh, you know when I'm playing. And there's also Facebook and Twitter. You know, you guys can use that. You know, a great way to communicate with me. You know, if there's any news or information, I I always put it up there. There's also my website at uh, gamingroach.com. So make sure you hit that up as well. It was great, and uh, and I couldn't have done it w without everybody that was involved uh, in this series. So thank you all. And I'm going to see you all at Season 3.